Okay, shot of you know that I'm lit. Yeah. It's all about money, baby. You know what I mean? Gotta chase that bag, you feel me? She got that coca, cola, bodies of soda. Oh yeah, she lit. So they gon' chase that bag with me. Sexy when she step out of the all black rover. Bad little bad bad got a thing. I'ma swerve up like a car, bro. All of these bottles I got, I'm lit. I'm lit. Tell the bands I'm a little mama, I'm sick. Oh, if you yeah. really want a nigga that can walk it out, crip. Sitting on 24 banging that bin. Your hair to your nose, so you figure you drip. Rich in the mug, out the kitchen with bricks. All of these niggas and bitches be wishing and wondering how the fuck you get rich. I be feeling like Gucci, I'm chasing this bag after bag. I wake up and then get it again. I rock with my low, I guess you can stay that. This Batman and Robin back at it again And I'm toting the folk Just in case niggas ain't know I have them blown off in the wind I'm riding through Reno Off in the Mino Stacking these M's La 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 bomba I'm really chasing them La 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 bomba Okay, shawty, you know that I'm lit Yeah What it do, baby, loves her for real, you just gonna do that. That's what you're gonna do. You just, you just gonna be nosy like that. You just gonna come around while I'm trying to start my shit. So fucking rude. So fucking rude. I was so nasty and so rude. So nasty and so rude. All right, what you do, baby? Last month. <laughs> <laughs> Mar I love me some Nene. Mariah Chrissy, aka Queen of the Midwest. So, your energy reading, your life, brother. Your big upset is so star, all that the above. I get the good, the bad, the ugly. And I get uh, the hell up out of here. And uh, I was thinking, that's my favorite part. What in the words of Little Wayne when I be talking fast? He said, it's not that I'm talking fast. You just listen to this little bitch, all right? Okay, so if it resonates, <laughs> if it resonates with you today, let it resonate but if not to leave it out of the door do not forget to hit that like share subscribe button and you already know i do personal reading so just whatever so we're gonna get right all up into it let's see what the energy is uh going on today so bless are coming out and are coming in i thank you for your beginning to our sins we thank you for all that you do and we give praises unto you i call upon my ancestors my angels my spirit guys all these to help me channel this message as boldly as i should i shall amen and shalom so definitely let's get right into it so definitely um I don't know if your doctor is gonna be sending you a uh, sending you a message because it says that you uh, uh it says sending a message in hospital doctor or nurse, but also somebody could be sending you a message about uh, them wanting to like heal something definitely. So it's like you are healing something. Somebody wants to work something out. Somebody wants to fix something. So you already know you go to the hospital that's fixing something that's making something better. So somebody could be uh like sending you a message to make you feel better or whatever. Definitely, but understand they could be sending you a message telling you that you are never alone. You are never alone. So this could like be you need like you possibly could be you needing some type of um like some type of healing or whatever. Definitely you could be like sitting looking at pictures and regretting some things or somebody could be feeling this about you, vice versa, or whatever. I don't know if you're like afraid to be by yourself or whatever, or you're just afraid like things is just not gonna work out for or whatever. Like you're afraid about like I don't know if like you're feeling hopeful about some type of seed that like you planted or whatever definitely or somebody could be going to the hospital because they're hopeful like it's a seed that they're like they're hoping that they're pregnant so if it's a situation to where like you want this baby then congratulations if you are but definitely you're like it's like you're hopeful full of faith so it's like um I feel like somebody is full of faith. I feel like somebody is going to send you like this message or whatever and hopefully it like plants a seed in your head to make you think about some things or whatever. It could be somebody that's afraid and terrified or whatever of like just like shit. You possibly don't. Sh to be honest, it could be somebody like just like afraid like you fucking somebody and getting pregnant. You could share kids with somebody. I wouldn't even want to read that but definitely what's the energies today? I, just, I don't know what that's about but shit. Whatever, we, whatever it is that you are crying about or whatever it won't happen overnight. I don't know if you've been in like uh some type of negative in like negative energy. I don't know if in like you just been growing tired, but this is confirmation, baby, that things are going to turn around. So smile because you have beautiful cheeks. What's that song? Smile for me. Can you just smile for me? Smile for me. Can you just smile for me? And all my people say, oh, oh, oh. Hey, 
big. You look so much better when you smile. You could be going to that concert or whatever. Definitely, they did just come here. But definitely, you look so much better when you smile, Virgo. So smile. Because things are going to be okay. Most definitely, you look so much better when you smile, bitch. So definitely, so let's get into it. Definitely, what I don't know is somebody going to be sending you a message about how they feel. But confirmation, this is your stardom to freedom. Like, like I said, freedom. So somebody could be like, freedom. Or for you, I don't know if you're listening to that or whatever, but like this is you are soaring to stardom. You're soaring, you're like you're soaring to like you're on the right path of doing what it is that you're supposed to do. So that's your energy, bitch. With confirmation, the energy is definitely somebody's about to contact you, bitch. Could be this, ah, oh, girl, get out of this energy, y'all. But somebody is about to uh, contact you or whatever. Somebody could be um, feeling ashamed about the situation or whatever. Definitely, somebody could be feeling uh, unworthy, humiliated, or whatever. But definitely, confirmation, there's going to be some type of support, some type of relief to where you could be soothed. You're going to be feeling at ease or whatever. What did I say? Freedom, free. It's okay. Definitely, somebody could be feeling um, discouraged. What else? What's other energies? Let me get a couple more energies. What other energies? Definitely, definitely. But somebody wants to. Um, Somebody wants you to have some open arms. They want you to be receptive towards uh, whatever it is that they bring, towards whatever it is that they say to you, whatever it's like. They want you to be. They want you to be open again to this. This person wants you to be open again. Confirmation. I said somebody is exhausted. I don't know. If somebody feels like they're ready to give up, but uh uh, we don't do that. You need to trust the process. Understand that things is gonna happen. Things don't happen overnight, but they are gonna happen. Trust the process. You have support. Understand that you have like these two tell you all the time. You got these two. I don't know who they are, but they, they stand beside you like the Beyonce video. Somebody's gonna have the confidence. You're gonna have the confidence or whatever, definitely, or whatever, the courage. Like you are bold. You are a confident person, but you if you have been dealing with some self-esteem issues, you're gonna have the confidence. Somebody can have the confidence to leap towards you, like but you um like you have faith, like you're leaping. I don't know if you started something, but like you're leaping into faith. You're like you're just like you're leaping into the unknown, definitely. But somebody is watching you, very envious. I don't know if you're in a relationship, but somebody is jealous of you. But it's somebody that's possessive of you, definitely. You're gonna be inspired. But I told you, somebody's gonna be inspired to write you. But you're gonna be uh, like inspired or whatever. I told you, somebody is worried. Didn't I say somebody worried about you having another kid again? Somebody worried about you having a kid. Again? What I say? Somebody worried about you being in love, had another kid again, but definitely your kids love you or whatever. So stop worrying or whatever, definitely. But um, it's also a situation to where you're going to find somebody coming devoted, definitely. Like, um, I feel like you're devoted to your kids or whatever, but I feel like somebody's going to be inspired to write you or whatever. You could be inspired to write a love song or something like that. But I feel like somebody is inspired or whatever, like, um, to write you. I don't know if this person is like... So, I don't know if it's a person, like, that's, like, worried about, I know for a fact, so it's a person that's worried about you being with somebody, sharing another kid with somebody, being in another relationship, being in love, but it also could be a situation to where it could be somebody that wants to write you and tell them, like, that they want, like, that they want to be with you type situation, so my bad, y'all, so definitely what I told you, confirmation, somebody could be uh, angry, I don't know if somebody writing you angry. But you're gonna be empowered, empowered, or you could be like feeling empowered to uh, to write a situation, or like to write. I said to write a situation could be this water sign, or you could be uh like needing to change your diet, or you could need to be like uh like drinking something, or uh, it's gonna be some type of idea. So you're gonna be inspired to do something. There's some type of idea, some type of vision, or something. I don't know if you're gonna dream it or whatever, but there's something that's about to come to you, or some type of bright idea that's gonna come to you, that's gonna help whatever situation this is gonna help grow, or whatever you are growing, or whatever it could be. I don't know if you're like well of course your earth sign but i don't know if this earth sign wants to like grow with you or whatever definitely but it could be this album coming out confirmation what did i say you are surrounded by high rank did i just say you surrounded by these damn angels it's okay somebody is forcing feelings some fight could have broke down somebody is forcing feelings with somebody so somebody's pretending with somebody but this karmic is keeping this karmic keeps them away from you I'm going to keep them away from you, but there's nothing wrong with you. There's nothing wrong with you. You possibly could need to, like, take a, a social media break or whatever, you know, create some boundaries or whatever. Definitely, somebody is very resistant or whatever to come towards you or whatever. Definitely, but you could have some more subscribers, some more followers. Definitely, you could be enjoying your life. Something could be, uh, um, you could be going on this date, could be linking up to uh, today, but today is Tuesday or next Tuesday. But somebody thought that they had better, like I said, but you could be working off some type of YouTube skits, you could be watching YouTube skits or whatever. But oh, bitch, a, 
somebody, a fight broke out, bitch, and somebody got beat the fuck up. Y'all be trying not to look at that shit, but somebody got beat the fuck up. You could be getting some pull-ups, some diapers, or some uh, or some wipes or whatever, or somebody could be busting you that you need to. Or somebody, oh, so somebody could have beat the, oh. So somebody that somebody could so he could, ooh, somebody could have beat this karmic ass, baby. And they possibly could have a kid with this person, but, um. You have all new that's coming. Definitely, what did I say? The karmic is a placeholder, but somebody could be coming towards you because you were recommended. But somebody be careful because somebody could be a, a peeping tom in your energy. Definitely, you could be needing to block somebody or something got blocked, or there was something got blocked or whatever. Well, I don't know if something is blocking you from moving or whatever, but I'm already there. Oh my, what the fuck? I want to read this, but you need to let yourself feel something. Something. But what is the other energies? Because I'm going to go down my bed. Ah, what did I say? That fly earlier. Somebody is stalking. Somebody being nosy in your business. But asking you should receive is something that you ask. And you will receive. You need to start filling your uh, You need to start filling your cup up first. So I told you, you possibly need to like take a social break. You need to take a social break from everybody. And fill your cup up first. Definitely. Somebody could see you as marriage material. Didn't I just tell you somebody could be writing you because they in love with you and they see you want to be with you? Definitely. Somebody could possibly not be getting out of town soon. Somebody wants some type of freedom. What did I say? Somebody could try to like cast some spells to try to block you from moving or something. But come on now. Could be your uh, your landlord. I don't know if your landlord is going to be on that bullshit. But it says uh, angel number. So I'm going to give y'all one in just a second. I don't worry about to get out of here. You could be seeing uh, 10 10. Definitely. Somebody could be like next flexing and uh, chill. This agency could be calling you. So karmic energy, you're protected from this karmic. You're protected from this karmic energy, definitely. Somebody is hard of hearing or whatever, definitely. But you could be uh having some type of Netflix, some type of chill. Somebody wants to do that, but you're in it. It's the end of a cycle. There's a cycle that's ended in this sense that uh oh, shit. Your angel number. So definitely your angel number today is six. Ah oh, shit. Six, two, six. Two and four. Hey, six, two, and four. Hey, and I'm been to Hey, I guess I'll read it for you and I'll get up out of here. That was that like, we want to read this shit. Six, two, four. What area code is that? Six, two, four. What's that waste? Put yourself to good use. There are talents and lessons you have been awarded. Hold on, you have been awarded but are not using. Hmm. Your angels remind you that you are here to make use of these gifts. Reflect on where in your life you are feeling trapped or tied down and determine what you can do to use your potential to the fullest. Didn't I just say that you're about to, uh, I don't know if somebody feel, I feel, I don't know if somebody feeling like their time is being wasted. I don't feel, I feel like you are like the talents that you have. Some of the talents like you are like they're, they're at waste. They're being wasted because you're not doing anything with that. But I told you it's also situations where I don't know if you feel like you feel like it's a waste. But don't worry because there is an idea that's coming towards you. And I'm telling you, but just put them talents to good use. Or somebody is a waste, bitch. Somebody I put in. Hmm. Hope it resonated.